To be honest, I'm not supposed to be out today as well. You can see how serious the condition is on the side of the street. My heart is filled with fear and worried. I can barely express myself, and I believe a lot of people are just like me. As someone born and raised in Wuhan, and also as a vlogger, what can I do? All I can do is being fully protected and show you firsthand what Wuhan really looks like. The highway we are on right now are normally a lot of traffic, but now only medical and construction-related cars can be permitted on the street. No private car allowed it. So of course, there is no more traffic. I took the risk, came out of the house today, is to show you from a first perspective what is the new coronavirus hospital looks like nowadays. And here we are. By the entrance, I already see a lot of supplies sent by individual and organization all over the country. I thank you very much. Now we are on the Lishan Shan Hospital construction site officially. It's really, really busy here, and we have to wear protections. To make sure the hospital completed on time and the quality is guaranteed, the machine does not stop 24 hours, and the workers take turns to rest. The patient number raises every day, so it's indeed a race against time. Leaving the hospital construction site to look at the construction site of the medical staff. To be honest, to see this many people working together, for a moment, I seems to forgot the severity of the epidemic and the silence of the city. Only when I see their mask on, do I remember that each of them is risking their life to help fight the disease. To enter the interior construction site, we need to take a temperature and register our names twice a day. Housing of the medical staff was raised above the ground and has two levels. The site visit of the Lishan Shan Hospital has now over. This used to be one of the busiest street in Wuhan. No matter day or night, I've never seen it quite like this. The Chinese New Year of 2020 is too special. We talk about courage, selflessness, united, and optimism. 
We know there's danger, but we still choose to do the right thing. And I think after all of this is finished, after all of this is settled, I will cherish my life more than ever before. This video is recorded and published on February 5th. It is the day of the Wuhan Tsinghua Medical Center hospital. The number of cases of the COVID-19 pandemic has reached 2,453,000 cases. But if you watch my video after watching my video, you will feel that you are 